Tell me I may listen. Teach me I might remember. Involve me I will understand. And so goes marriage to Lauren and Brandon. If I speak in human and angelic tongues, but do not have love, I am a resounding gong or a clashing cymbal. If I have the gift of prophecy and comprehend all mysteries and all knowledge, if I have all faith so as to move mountains, but do not have love, I am nothing. If I give away everything I own, and if I hand my body over so that I may boast, but do not have love, I gain nothing. Love is patient, love is kind. It is not jealous, it is not pompous. It is not inflated, it is not rude. It does not seek its own interest. It is not quick-tempered, it does not broad over injury. It does not rejoice over wrongdoing, but rejoices with the truth. It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. Love never fails. The word of the Lord. First time I'd like to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Brandon and Lauren. Acknowledging and accepting your faults and strength as you do mine. For all the time we have been together, there has always been the kind of mutual understanding which is only shared when there is true love. So on this day, I give you my heart. My promise that I will walk with you, hand in hand, wherever our journey leads us. Living, learning, loving, together, Forever. Where I am, won't you reach me now? I need you, me, ocean. I'm honored and so happy to be standing next to you today in front of all of our closest friends and family on one of the joyous days of both of our lives. We moved so quickly, but it's because we knew this was the real deal. In the beginning, we used to say, This can't be real life, no one can be this happy. And honestly, every day I still think the same thing. How can two people really be this happy? I vow to be with you through sickness and in health until death do we part. Brandon, I promise to love you until I take my, my last breath. I love you.